Good morning. I'm Matt Adams, and what I wanted to do today was talk to you guys about uh, buying a house. So it's probably one of the most important things you can do in life if you want to be financially stable and uh, just for building wealth. So a house is, in my opinion, the best investment you can have. As long as you buy it in a good area, they all go up over time. You might have to sit on them for a while, but the reality of it is, is they're going to make you some money. You just got to be able to pay the bills. And there's a lot of creative ways to do it, to get a property. So anyways, what I was going to show you guys today is this one that we bought. We've had it for about a year now. And they're... You know, there's a lot of time and effort into them, but that's just the name of the game. What I like to say is sweat equity, but what you want to do with these things is buy a wedge deal. So what I mean by that is you want to buy a property under value. Um, and typically the way that you get these is they've been run down and they need a lot of work. So. I'm all about work and I believe firmly in, you know, working for what you got. So that's what I do. But I got help too. Uh, I'll introduce you to my fiance one of these days. She's the reason all this is taking place, really. She's a hustler. Um, so what I do is I'm a contractor and she's a realtor and we've put our two minds together and been able to make a fortune and so i just wanted to share with you guys and show you how you can do it so what we'll do is we'll start with this house right here and we flipped i'd say probably four of them last year and uh this is one of them that we bought. And so what, what you're looking for is a property like this, right? So this thing, as you can tell, it needs a lot of work. And it's in a whole lot better shape right now than it was. When we first bought this thing, you couldn't even see that building right there. This line of bushes, it's right here it was a line of blackberry bushes that high all the way across this thing all the way to that barn right there there's actually a big tree laying on that barn this whole field you could see across here you couldn't even see it it was unbelievable the amount of just overgrowth there was right through here. And I mean, I'm telling you guys, you could get a lot done if you really get after it. So anyways, I got my helpers here with me today. Bandit and Remy, they, I love dogs, so they pretty much come with me everywhere I go as long as I can bring them. And I pretty much can because I'm in control of my life. I do whatever I want, pretty much. But anyway, so here's this house, right? As you could tell, like I told you, it's it's rough, right? It's rough. But you watch by the end of the summer, you won't even recognize this thing. And I'll I'll got, I'll keep you guys updated. This yard it was about two feet tall of grass. So, anyways, as you could tell, needs a lot of work. I didn't even notice it until right now, but there's a piece of siding coming off right there, which I'm gonna have to fix that because we don't need rain getting in here pretty quick. But yeah, it's just, it's rough, right? So this is what I'm talking about. You wanna keep your eye out for stuff like this. You can make a fortune on properties like this 
and especially if you can talk to the owner and come up with some um, different financing. So what I like to do is try to do for sell by owner because what that does is it actually works in everybody's benefit. So a lot of times what people are trying to do is they're trying to keep from paying huge taxes on their properties. So they'll do a 1031 exchange. Well, if you can buy them for sell by owner, they don't have to pay that big tax right up front. So it actually benefits the homeowner. And then also you could pay them interest. So they're actually making more money than what the actual loan is that you have with them. And that works out great for them because a lot of the times they'll be older folks and you know they're retired and so they need a little income but anyways i just wanted to show you guys kind of what to look for and if you need any help on trying to come up with a plan to get into a property you can contact me i'm all about helping people figure stuff out see the roof on this thing that's getting replaced this whole building i'm gonna reside it i mean it's gonna look like brand new and i'm done with it it's rough now and this thing was completely full of stuff just a cleanup on this property took probably a month to where it's at now i mean it's unbelievable the amount of work that we did here I got an excavator and just went to town on this thing. We had guys here just cleaning up the trash like crazy. Um, had these kids helping. I mean, it's, it's a full-time job. It's sweat equity is what it is. And that's where you really come up quick. Well, look at this cool barn. And you know, it needs work too. I'm working on it, kind of slowly chipping away at it. But this is super neat place, right? Look at that. How cool is that? This barn's probably 100 years old, you know? Right, and I understand this is a lot bigger chore than some people would be willing to take on. But for me, this is like paradise. I love big, big chores. See all this property right here? Every bit of that come with it. Five acres. I mean, the possibilities are endless, right? That's what I like. I mean, this barn is gonna be a fun place to hang out. But anyways, I just wanted to kind of explain to you guys what to look for and how to make some money because that's the goal, right? We all want to be financially independent, wealthy, and the way to do it is through property. And the coolest part with that is with a piece of property, if you could come up with the terms, I mean, you could buy a $300,000 piece of property for anywhere from twenty to sixty thousand dollars and you're in charge of it once you get that contract signed so if you just sit on it and make the payments maybe get a renter to make the payments um you know over say six months to a year you could cash out refinance that thing and get a loan you could even make some money doing that and pay off the homeowner if you want 
or just take that money and go buy another one. Um, like I said, with property, the opportunities are endless and such a good way to build wealth. The best way, in my opinion. Um, obviously, we're professionals at what we do, so, you know, I could spot a property that's a good investment and with Katie being a realtor we could figure out the value of it and what it's worth fixed up and so you have the difference right there so um, and I'm willing to help you guys if you have any questions or you know even if you want to go in on us with some of these properties um, we're always looking for investors. Um, the reality of it is the bigger team that we have, the more properties that we can get a hold of, the more properties we could get a hold of, the more money everybody makes. And we're all about helping people out. So let's do this the way I look at it. If you want to be a part of this, let me know and we can make it happen. Um, I'm full time finding properties like these. I mean, almost every day I could find these things. And the opportunity is endless, I'm telling you guys. Um, there's a deal of a lifetime once a week. If you could figure out the deal, that's the trick to it. You have to figure out the deal. It needs to work for everybody. But the way I look at it is you want to bring people along with you. You don't want to be greedy with it. And so that's why I'm reaching out um, to you guys and just trying to help everybody. Um, I'm telling you right now, you start fixing these things up, you're churning up all kinds of jobs. And you know you're helping society out i mean you clean these things up it helps every one of these neighbors you know it brings the value of their property up they they don't want stuff looking trashy around them you know it helps them do something because then they're like well my neighbor's house looks better than mine you know i better get to doing the yard i mean i'm telling you it, it puts everybody to work and that's really what you want. You don't want people sitting around in their house all depressed, especially right now with this COVID crap going on. Uh, people need some sunlight and some happiness in their life. And fixing these things up, it does it for you and your neighbors. Everybody feels good about it in the end. And that's really what we're looking for. Uh, peace of mind, more money in our bank account, uh, more opportunity to help people. I mean, it just ripple effects through society. And I really believe in helping people out. So let's do this, right? Like I said, if you want a piece of the pie, connect with us. Hit that like button, subscribe to this channel, and let's build this into something that nobody can stop us. I mean, the sky's the limit in my opinion. So let's do it.